so good in their 2 nothing win over the Soviets and the play blown offside. And Romania at the Stadio della Vittoria. Plays it forward for Lakatush. Happen in the midfield for Romania. His combinations with Lakatush will be critical. The foul is on the spectacular three kings. Mozani lays it back to the top of the area. Here's a chance. The through ball, lovely. Here's a chance off the right wing. Oh, and they cut it back the other way. And Radio Chu with a chance from Dinamo Bucharest. The Indians have had the run of play. Headed up and over the bar by Oman Bia. Close enough to have a crack, but in his BA, and if he gets a, a stride going here, he might just get away from the defender taken on by Makinaki. And unfortunately for Cameroon, referee had blown. Otherwise, Makinaki was on quite the only striker they've got up there of any size. <laughs> well, that's more than ambitious. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. Yep, the only country not to have done so in the finals. Free kick. This time it is for Romania, though. Have a go. But uh, Haji unable to keep the shot down just as long ball and, uh, turned back and again they're not afraid to have a go and that time the shot came in from Mabawang. Not afraid to come forward and uh, doing well here for Pescu. Takes a real leap. And a tackle and I think we're going to have a booking. Well, Cameroon had two players booked in the first game as well as two. There's a good shot and a fine save by Kono. What a great strike from Aji and what a... Valderrama, nice kick. The Romanians, though, continue to take the play to the Cameroon. Another foul this time. Another chance and Kono, the rebound and final... They certainly know how to defend the Cameroon. They're well organized, John. You know, they're picking up... Uh... He might try a shot as well, and just like... Very entertaining to watch, but the final ball, John, is the one that's let them down. Abduan, for his pains, has been rewarded with a free kick. Cameroon with the free kick, and it's Kundi who takes it. And, uh, this time it's a Romanian who stays down, having got a bang on the head. Boot, trying to wrestle his way around the defender, and plays an instinctive ball forward to Radicau. It really was a lovely ball again from Lacatouche, and once more. Okay. My stopwatch had let me down there, but uh, definitely going to have a free kick here. I don't know what else. Here's the free kick, and that's no trouble for Ancono. Stretches Looks more like a cross. Here's a useful ball. He's onside. Makinaki, what a chance! The Romanians go absolutely potty with the linesman. Makinaki got in behind the defender. Oh, and a cynical challenge by Klein, who brought the man down there. And that should certainly be a yellow kick to lose the ball, but there's no time for the Romanians to make it count. Stadium in Bari, Della Vittoria, seating 58,000. Eddie, good ball, Makinaki again. Well, Makinaki's take. He'll keep this one in, and there's danger here, and it was coming towards Biek. Fairly transparent. Bit of Hollywood stuff there. But again, Lakitu stay. Emmanuel Kunde, who played in 82 and can hit them, and that's a good strike. And it was on target, and uh, Pastor playing with a heavier ball. Position, and he's here inside the area. Makinaki with a chance for Cameroon. And Lung goes 
across to denying. His free kick will be taken by Lakatouche. Oh, that was dodgy. That would have been the flukiest goal of the championship so far. Just struck a camera player on the way. Well, I thought he might try the shot, but uh, instead the cross has comes in. That was uh, flicked. Lakatouche with the throw. Kono comes for it, and he's never going to get that. And Radicawi could have benefited. And that's the first time that Uncona really has been caught out, and uh, that wasn't good goalkeeping. No. Here's a free kick. There's a simple header for Uncona. Miller. Here's... Oh, Beek. Well, they plenty of man up. Uh, that's really disappointing. Sabo, get the ball in, many men around the box, could do them. Lovely turn by Lakatu, she really fooled the defender I think there. He was goaded into conceding the free kick. Leicester's on Fede and Miller streaks off towards the penalty area to try and get on the end of the return cross. That's the best we've seen actually in this second half. Good counter attack. Fede really should have gone. Very good game. Here's Tato's cross towards Biek. And Biek tries to get on the wrong side of the defender. And I'm afraid he's rubbed the referee up the wrong way. That's a great ball to Sabo. Lovely back flick to Lakatouche. Almost looking for the trip, I think, there. Caused them problems. Romania defending easily against those. He's a big enough fella, Stephen Tato. Slim, Miller, Miller scores a goal for Cameroon! It's come from nowhere! From the man who has made the most romantic comeback of the World Cup, surely. Roger Miller, 38 years of age, scores the goal that sends those fans into ecstasy. And really, you've got to look at the defender here. Well, let's be honest, up till now, but here come Romania. We're going to see the real Lakatus in this game. There's the cross, and Kono says... ...of uh, Cameroon. Splendid free kick, excellent save from Lung. Danger not averted yet, though. Oh, that's well played, Lakatus! A little header from Lakatus, which could have sneaked in that post. But it's not his day at the moment. So he's going to run over the top of this one, allowing Fede to strike it. As well, and I'm not afraid to have a crack. Which has done really well here, though. There could be an equaliser on the cards. Still the chance there. Can he get two? Roger Miller! It's his day, all right. He must be the happiest man. The substitution of Miller lifted the whole thing. Oh, it's one of those great World Cup stories. Trumps once more. There's going to be a goal in their own net, though. Scored by Gabriel Ballant. Oh, and trouble down there, I'm afraid, between Uncono and Lacatouche. There was no need for what followed Lupescu. Now the cross coming over towards Uncono. And oh, it's come through to Biek. Couldn't quite make it three. And the story goes on for Cameroon. They beat Argentina. You're watching Italia 90, a presentation of Volson Canadian.